Connection to the aftermath of a mass shooting nearly a year ago. Brian Mastery talked with the victim's family who are struggling to process what happened in court today. Probation is the sentence for a suspect involved in an Omaha mass shooting a year ago. The victim's mother says this doesn't look like justice. I'm not quite sure how to feel right now. Everything is a whirlwind. For the last year, Amber Wood has been stuck in the mud of emotion, struggling to process the murder of her 20 year old daughter, Carly, a roller coaster no parent wants to get on. And she says this ride never ends. I hope that Tyvell does stay out of trouble and does the right thing. The defendant, Tyvell Lampkin Davis, was not one of the gunmen that day. After the gunfire, though, he hid a gun given to him by one of the alleged shooters and then lied about it. He'll be on probation for the next five years. I just hope that he is truly remorseful. Probation is a gift. It's not something that should be taken lightly. And I hope that he takes it seriously. I hope that as he grows and teaches his son um, that he thinks of Carly every day that he does that and that he thinks about the positive things about my sister and not that tragic night. In court, the defendant told the family that he was sorry. First of all, it's very important for Tyvell and his family to acknowledge Carly Wood's tragic loss. November 13th, 2022, an early morning house party at 33rd and Ames ended in a flurry of bullets. Carly Wood was struck eight times by three shooters. Seven other people were injured, including men later determined to be suspects. Carly's mom has been frustrated no one has come forward to share information about the other two shooters of her daughter. He was very intoxicated. He had been shot almost fatally, and he just doesn't have a good memory of what happened in that room. It's, it's a dark room. He wasn't in there for very long. For the Carly Wood family, their whirlwind call for justice continues into next month as the trial begins for Imhotep Davis, the man believed to have fired a fatal shot, as well as sentencing for Kawan Dampier, who was found guilty today in connection to the same mass shooting. Prosecutors said he had a gun while on federal probation and fired it that day. On your side in Omaha, Brian Mastry, 6 News. Ampere will be sentenced November 29th. The jury trial for Imhotep Davis begins November 13th, a year to the day of Carly Wood's murder.